just an incredible feat of, uh, of dance, of uh, rock climbing, of cinematography. There's a lot of really uh, interesting elements that came together to make this one. Uh, location scouting uh, definitely included in that list. Uh, yeah, I just think it was out of this world, absolutely worth checking out. It's just it's cool. impressive. It's just so impressive what these people were able to do and, and uh, filming it because, you know, it's not just them on the cables. It's also going to be the crew and, like, the camera the camera people. Um, yeah, I mean, it's just such a, a physically taxing short, I'm sure, to make, but it was so beautiful and, like, the setting itself is so beautiful. Uh, this is one of the most interesting dance films I've, I've probably ever seen. Uh, wow, it's a really interesting piece. Um, I don't know where that location is, but it's extraordinary. And the costumes, together with the movement and the, and the music and the special effects and the editing and cinematography, boy, they really uh, put together something captivating. So. This is my reaction. <laughs> I was watching, I was like, no way. Wow, wow. First of all, right from the start, Hopefully, people that listen to it get to watch it with headphones because you get to hear the um, the buzzing of the bee in the like switching between the left and right ear, um, the left and right speaker, uh, which is a really cool effect. I love I love that. Um, but these dancers were just defying gravity. <laughs> Um, I just can't even imagine how much fun that must have been um, being suspended and being able to dance just yeah, just floating there, being suspended. Um, the movements were um, so precise and the, every single part of this was so creatively focused and precise. Um, and I really liked the last shot of her kind of um, propelling herself off the rope and having her arms stretched out and seeing the, the spray of what I interpreted to be pollen. But this was just, it was short and it was impactful and it was just so impressive. I was watching it like, no, seriously? How are they? So obviously I loved it. Great job. And I'm sure that that was probably most people's reaction to this too. It was an absolute piece of art. It was so weightless and the cliff dancing looked effortless. Uh, I really liked how the sound mixers incorporated the buzzing of bees um, and the sound mix in general gave me an adrenaline boost while watching. I loved the costumes and the gold uh, flecks of wax on their shoulders. Um, the fine details and how the film editors added pulsating hexagons and um, kind of like an, a zero gravity element to the phone. It was uh, pretty phenomenal, actually. I loved this. I thought it was so innovative. It was so fun. It was something that I never would have thought of. And to have those dancers like on the ropes and then the, you know, the camera played with gravity and direction and what is up and down and I loved the way that it was all edited together and the shapes that they were able to make because they were you know using the ropes and using all these different elements were so fascinating and the way that they edited some of those shapes or some shapes in with the movie as well I thought was really well done because it wasn't too in your face you noticed the shapes and that they were there but it wasn't it didn't distract from what else was going on in the shot or in the scene and i loved that um i like there was just it was just cool like it was just like it, it was one of those things where i was like this would have been so fun to do like this that experience like watching it like it just seemed really cool this is a wild little trip um amazing play with the rhythm and the use of the music it paired excellently and you can tell the editing I uh, did that intentionally, which I appreciated. Uh, really mesmerizing watching these acrobats gliding with such ease and grace in a very cool location, great location scouting. And the, the frenzy of the music really did capture that, that be like quality and the, the jump cuts and um, some of the franticness of it was, was cool. Daring 
it's like a flash in the pan. It comes and it goes uh, in the blink of an eye. But it's, it's, it's quite intense in its two minute duration and shows obvious uh, iconography that is associated with bees. And uh, we have a, a mountainous setting and locale, which is interesting because that's not necessarily what you think of when you think of bees. Yet it um, is uh, an effective uh, juxtaposition together. And again, the stunts performed in it alongside the dancing is daring and ambitious and very well done.